Alright gang, so apparently if you just uh, stand here, the title of the level shows up, so that's interesting. I gotta look at something. Uh, let's... Okay, so here's our world map. Okay, so here's our percentages. So, oh, there's percentages for question mark blocks? You gotta be kidding me! Oh, man, this is, makes it even worse. Oh my god, I am not getting 100%. I just tell you what. So we are missing at least one toad. Where are we going to find a toad? Ooh, what's this? This looks... This looks weird. Nope. This looks suspicious. Random hole. Okay, this, uh, this game is going to be a completionist nightmare. Oh my god. So... Okay, we're still on the level, at least. Oh, hi. Hey, did anyone ever teach you not to step on the step on the gods? You step on our god, you get a divine punishment! Hey, I'm worshipping here! Ah, oh, sorry. So, yeah, we're... So we're still missing some toads, at least. I say we're still in the level, but now we just got sent back to the beginning of the level. So now I'm gonna develop the habit of looking for anything even remotely suspicious. So I have no idea what that could be. I've always thought these platforms were suspicious. It's like there could be a freaking invisible block on one of these platforms! Seriously, this is like the... It's like the only Paper Mario game that counts hidden blocks, or question mark blocks rather, to your percentage. Like, holy frick! Way to drive players crazy, Nintendo! Okay, I feel like I didn't search- whoa. I feel like I didn't search this area too thoroughly. There could easily be, like, something secret here. Like on this thing. Oh my god. There could easily be something like a hidden block or something on this! Oh my god. There is that one. It's like, I trust there to be like indicators or something, you know? Freaking indicators for like hidden blocks and whatever. At least there's a shortcut there. I, I, I feel like I didn't really explore this, um... Hang on. Yeah. I feel like I didn't explore that little flame cavern too thoroughly, you know? I feel like I was kind of trying to jump my way through it, but I didn't really give it that much attention. Yay, this room again. At least I know what to do for this room. Okay, I feel like I searched this room pretty well, because I was just kind of confused here for a while. At least until I found out where to go here. It's like you can barely see that, honestly. Okay, what if I get off it? There's a cat out there. There's a cat out there. <laughs> 
Oh god. I don't know what would have happened. It sits out there. This one I think is confusing. It's weird that some of these these holes don't even have five. Actually, the side that doesn't even have a hole is kind of suspicious. See, everything in this game is freaking suspicious. And every edge in this level is a freaking spike pit. I feel like I'm, I can jump on that if I try. And be down here? Nope. My word, this game is gonna be a nightmare for me. We're gonna completely have to look for every little thing. Whoa! Oh my god. This will be my first game over, too, I'll tell you what. Oh my god! Oh my god, this is ridiculous. Okay, let's look for, like, one of these fire things that's open or something. I don't know. I have to just keep going. I really don't see... See, I feel like there's something suspicious in this room. Like, there's gotta be some kind of secret. And I'm dead! Because I just walked off by accident. <laughs> Alright, first game ever, people! <laughs> oh, I didn't even read that. Um, did it say restart from last save? Okay. Whatever. Let's... I'm not even gonna worry about it anymore. Let's just get the fuck out of here. Maybe near the end, I'll just look up a walkthrough on finding all the frickin' toads, like I swear. This game is just gonna be a completionist nightmare. So you check all of these. Put the coins on and give the speech. Fears will grow into glorious woman will call like the earth ball is mental. Oh! Oh, there's a toad! I guess all that backtracking was just for nothing. Oh, I was just getting the hang of being a bug. Had a great little hiding spot picked up to freak out the next pilgrim. And that was the last toad! Wow, what a pointless backtracking. Hi, dry bones. I keep knocking on the rock for good luck, but my luck's still on the rocks. <laughs> That's hilarious. Well, no, 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 no. I have no idea where the freaking uh, coin blocks are, but screw that shit. Freaking invisible coin blocks. Well, since we're here, let's check this level. Uh, we have found no collectible treasures. Holy shit. Um, so there's still stuff we can do here on Picnic Road. What are you? Welcome. Oh, you're a shop. Not bad. Ooh, not bad. Uh. I don't have this one, do I? Okay, so we can actually buy treasures at the shop. Okay. Not bad. You want that one? Why would you want that one? If you want it, it might be valuable, and therefore it's not for sale. <laughs> well, you're a dick. Let's just buy some stuff just to be safe. I'm gonna buy like 10 of these. Not really. I'll just uh, keep it like that for now. Uh, I want to 
wouldn't mind a few mushrooms, actually. Yes, thanks for reminding me every 10 seconds. Oh yeah, that's what I thought you'd be. You were thinking about using me when you thought I was a mushroom, weren't you? Admit it! I didn't know what you were. I, I was thinking about it. <laughs> Alright. Um... Alright, we've already been down here. Oh, let my, let my confetti, thank you. Want to buy a fortune? There's just... Oh, okay. And so it's gonna be... Here it comes! Oh! Thank you? Okay! Just a random ass star. This is suspicious. What is this? Pokemon Bar, get your fresh walk one. Okay. So I guess we had to save all these people in here before I could do all that. Okay. That was worth it. Yeah, he popped all the corn, all right. See, the entire crew now he can work on the maximizing product off of the whole thing. It's a miracle. <laughs> nice. I'm not gonna get that star until I know what it's for. But they can't just have that star there for nothing. Okay, what are accessories? Ah. Oh! Oh, yes! Oh, get that! <laughs> so are these permanent, or can we use them up? Huh. I want my extra HP. Shouldn't spend too many coins. Okay, okay, they're giving me reasons to spend coins now, so I shouldn't be too. I should be a little cautious. I'm gonna, I'm gonna equip that one right now. Freaking, this will be helpful. Okay, so it looks like. Oh yeah, so there's. Uh, it looks like these are permanent. Oh, I can even have this one active. Okay, I'm gonna keep that one active. This is, okay, this is interesting. Uh, I'll tell you what, no, that's, that's, that's gonna be kinda cheap. Um, okay, so, I'm going to have it off when I go through a level the first time. But, when I'm at the end of the level, I'm gonna turn it on so I can backtrack and look for the toads. It's like, is this not as fun when I'm just alerted to where they are, you know? It's not as fun. Huh? Alright, can we see if he got stronger when your HP went up? I bet you could beat one of those humans with a single hammer strike or jump without going into battle. Okay, good, I was waiting for something like that to happen. So I, lo I love doing that, I love just instant killing enemies on the first strike. Um, because technically there are still more things we can do. Now that being said, as soon as I get a gadget that lets me detect where invisible blocks are, I am keeping that on at all times, baby. It's like, that is just bullshit that you expect me to find all those. Oh, hello! Screw off. What's your deal? Oh, no, no. Oh, you just talk about that. Okay, let me actually look at the map for this place. So... Okay, we got this... Okay, I think the last toad we need to rescue is actually the guy in the house, maybe. That probably counts. 
Not bottomless holes, that's hilarious. Um... Yeah. So, you know, I'm not actually going to worry about getting everything here until I actually, uh... Um... Until we can actually get rid of that red banner and actually save the toad. Because, like, that's, like, the one area in this level we can't really explore yet. But once we have that uncovered, we can look, look, try to look for everything else. You know? Oh my god! No, 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 I do not want to fight you guys again. <laughs> oh, fuck. Well, I do need to make some coins back, so why not? <laughs> Should've got the one that makes more time, honestly. At least do this, maybe. I was just kind of discombobulated there, so sorry. Does this mean my jump attack is stronger? No, the jump attack's still the same, unfortunately. I'm not gonna waste iron boots on them, though. I don't really feel stronger yet. I only finish them off this turn. Oh, it says not my attack power up, so that's fair. Now it's my percentage for this level, because I gotta check this every five seconds now. Uh, we hit a fair amount of blocks. So, in Paper Mario 1 and 2, um... Oh, there's a hidden place down there! So, like, in Paper Mario 1 and 2, um... We never actually came up here, did we? So, like, the quest bar blocks were permanent. They just didn't go to any visible percentage counter. In Mario RPG, there was a percentage counter for quest bar blocks, so... Yeah, I guess they just brought it back from Mario RPG. Oh, you found me just for a forward because I'm myself to return to your loneliness. Plus one! <laughs> oh, you're picky, aren't you? <laughs> Fill up already! Jeez, that was a picky one. Oh, okay. Listen, do you hear that? It's the river going splish splash. Ah, what a relaxing sound. I agree. Who listen closer? You can even hear the fishies jumping. All right, that's that's pretty nice. Uh, can I actually go down there from here? What's this say? Insects, insects are people too. Please be kind to our creepy, many-legged friends and perch slowly. <laughs> Okay, so it actually gives you a hint on how to solve the, um, how to get those insects, but I already figured it out, because it's basically the same mechanic from Color Splash. But, uh, and also that the insects literally are people because they're actually toads. <laughs> oh, hi. Get. 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 Anything hidden around here? Oh, yeah, we already found that. Do you have anything else? Oh, we gotta be slugging for some of those pieces of these rooms. <laughs> Is there a collectible up here? Nah. Now, this is like probably the only time in Paper Mario with a with a sentient and friendly Monty Mole. So yeah, that's an interesting development. Pretty cool. 
So we gotta go back down to this fishing guy, because I just saw that secret down there. Did I never check back here? How did I not check back here? It's kind of obvious. But I guess it wasn't. Well, a sap sister. Okay, so that's what they're called, the sap sisters. With their leader being grand sappy. This got really disturbing somehow. Okay. Yeah, I don't want to think about what the sap sisters and grand sappy do when I'm not around. Ugh, spinies. Did I ever go down there, or was I afraid of the spinies? Let's just check down there, I guess. Yes, this does look dangerous. Is this go behind the spinies? Go behind the spinies, okay. I almost jumped on the spinies and stupid. You just follow me around, you little prick. So I guess some of the secret things, the, the, the remaining collectibles can be hidden up where the, um... Hidden up at the station up here, so let's just go up and open it. This looks like you can peel it off. Wow. Like, everything is just so suspicious in this game. It's crazy. Here we go. We get to watch this again. Oh, wait, I can skip it. Okay. I'm gonna skip it because it's just the same animation. Alright. Um, that's roughly the same size. Alright, shake it like a piece of outdated photographic paper. Ha <laughs> ha The pom poms are part of the aesthetic. Or part of the piece, rather. Alright. Alright, new, new place. Well, not bad if I say so myself. Question is, what's back here? There's gotta be a secret back here. Well, the camera's not turning, I'm trusting there's not a secret. Oh, this is a whole whole other section. Doesn't look that big. Overlook Tower. Is this a dungeon? We were just in a dungeon. Okay, this looks pretty interesting. Oh wow. I already see a toad. Oh, I see a friggin' toad in there. Whoa, look at the size of those mushrooms! And that banana that can feed an army. Wait, there's something off about them, isn't there? Oh, they're just drawings, but it's paper. Sorry if I got your mouth watering there, Mario. <laughs> Yikes, that's one of the biggest holes you've seen, isn't it? Looks like you'll need plenty of cafe mixed up, I'm afraid. I see a toad hidden in there, too. I see a, see, I see a toad over on the left. Alright. Spam it! That literally used up the whole thing, didn't it? Hey, you fixed that huge hole! Oh my gosh, that's my brother's face! This one I can tell is a drawing right away. It is really well done, though. It must have been the same artist who drew the banana and the mushrooms. Wait, that means... Whoever drew this news my brother, I don't know how, but there's no other explanation. So like, this is... Like, this is obviously one of the, the main quest locations, because we're going to de destroy one of the banners here. And those are our main collectibles. We got to know each other pretty well while we were all rolled up. <laughs> and they're just going to sit over there, apparently. So that means this can't really be a huge area. It's probably just like... It's just a, a mini-boss dungeon. You were obvious. Yes, you noticed me! Whoa, that's quite a drawing! Now that I can see it, I kind of wish I'd been a part of it, you know? Sorry. Oh, money. Money, 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 money. Is that all? I 
see something over here. You are extremely obvious. Don't tell you. Don't tell my boss, but I mostly just stand here all day doing nothing. So that attack was pretty exciting. <laughs> yeah, you see that now. Thanks, Mario. Come see me on the second floor if you get hungry. I work in the restaurant there. Oh, oh, okay, that's pretty convenient. Yeah, thanks, Mario. Now I can get back to selling tasteful souvenirs and tasty items. You're in the market for either the thing salt by any time. Okay. Uh, Alright, right here. Welcome. I lied about the souvenirs for the sake of wordplay, but I do have tasty items. Take a look. <laughs> There's a lot of bunch of mushrooms, but... Okay, yeah, I'll remember that. Okay, we're obviously going to fight a boss here. Even though we just fought a boss. No, you're ripping me! There's gotta be a better way! <laughs> ah, that's better. Welcome to Overlook Tower, Mario. The tower with the gift shot. We're still working on that slogan. <laughs> and it looks like we've got some major cleaning to do as well. This artwork isn't bad, mind you, but every time I see it, I'll think of that monster that attacked us. It was horrible. A thin, rattling body with a huge mouth full of all manner of things. <laughs> you think a monster did this? I didn't know my brother was friends with monsters because it has to be someone who knows his face. Well, I know you're scared, but Mario's here now. That means there's nothing to fear, right, Mario? Let's save this dead obvious toad. Wee! I haven't had that much fun at work in ages, so we falling back up for another ride? <laughs> Still have some confetti left, but not nearly enough. Where can we find more confetti? Let's go in here. There's apparently four floors in this place. Hey, can you humor me for just a second? Ahem. Now passing the third floor. Cosmetics, handbags, pen slacks, oranges, perfume, and camping gear. How do you even know? Have you been to this place before? All right, we're just gonna cut right up to the to the boss room. Next, salt fourth floor. Bicycles, benches, formal wear, blenders, and comic books. How'd I do? I always wanted to be an elevator operator in one of those fancy department stores. I'm actually not too clear about what a fancy department store is, but it sounds fun, right? Mind if I do the same thing in reverse on the way down? <laughs> Pencils. Whoa, that was way too close. What are these sticks making us stuck? Ooh, they positively ruined my department store fantasy. Unless... Dear elevator presenters, there will be a slight delay when my friend Mario takes care of this emergency. Psst, do something, Mario. Okay, simple enough. Can these hurt me? No. <laughs> I feel like they should be super painful. At least they were RGB pencils. Oh, and now we're going to fall to the bottom. We have to go up this dungeon the normal way, right? Going down! First floor, absolutely fun princesses, crushed dreams, broken glass, and athletic wear. Is this athletic wear? Oh my god! I like the setting here. Uh, let me think. Uh... This one, maybe. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm confused. So I'm just gonna leave it like this. On the right side, they are good, though, so I can just do this. Oh crap! Oh my god! Oh my god, that was horrible.
I didn't realize that last one was uh, freaking um, normal Goomba. Or in care Goomba, even. See, it said that I might. That I got stronger, but I'm not really stronger, only outside of battle. Like when I get a first strike or something. So I don't really understand what changed. I don't really feel that different. I was wondering how to get that last one, but I guess this is good enough. Here we go. You're all still considered Paragoombas. It's weird. I guess he had the same amount of high HP, apparently. That'll make our confetti back. Oh, and this still saves. Does it actually save? I know in Color Splash, if you don't complete um, a colorless spot completely, it doesn't save if you like leave the area and come back in. It's like you had to recolor it and stuff. I wonder if that's different here, unless we didn't technically enter a load zone. Feels like we entered a load zone. Yikes. We're gonna need more we're gonna need more uh, confetti though. Oh no, not these stairs too, and I can't imagine you have much confetti right now, you're <laughs> damn right. Do you think we can even find enough confetti here to fix them? Oh it's the toad chef! Hey, I, I couldn't help over hearing, and I might be able to help. Something real bad is going on at my restaurant right now. I don't even want to say it out loud. I'm the head chef, but I can't really show my face until it's cleared up. You are the same head chef from Color Splash. Can you help me? Take care of the palm, keep it on the down low, and I'll make it up to you. Oh, found that easy. That was the only question mark block! Oh my god, this is the first level where he found all the question mark blocks because it's that easy. Oh my god, that is... That's just disrespectful, game. Is that supposed to be me? What was the artist thinking? I'm a blue toad, not a red toad. Also, the spots are a little askew. Oh, sorry, I should be cleaning you, at least of all after you just rescued me. Okay, let me make it up to you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I, I, I could use more mushrooms, to be honest. You don't know what is going to happen. And they even had this little painting here to indicate it. Oh my god, this game just doesn't believe in me, and I hate it. These drawings are kind of a nice aesthetic, though. Chef special omelet and truly wild rice! At least this game's being a bit more diverse than food. Where could we find confetti anyway? But it's obviously the, that's obviously the, the theme for this level, is that you need a lot of confetti for each thing. I don't have to worry about push more blocks anymore. Oh, eat? Okay, don't mind if I do. <laughs> That's it? <laughs> You're going to come back and pay for that later, aren't you? <laughs> Maybe. Something in here. Thanks for that, Mario. Just a tip. I wouldn't order anything from the kitchen either the safest food soldiers left it in. <laughs> well, I already ate, so, okay. this. Oh, we can get up here. Anything up here? Um, there's a really big bug. A really big bug? Really big one. It's like a stinging bug. It's this big. Really? It's like a giant. Take a picture of it. it. <laughs> I'm like, uh oh. <laughs> So hi, Toad. <laughs> Those are kind of exciting if you just throw everything into one drawer. Yeah, 
Well, thank you for that. Fun fact, I weigh as much as a single carrot. Haha, <laughs> really? One of those little things threw me behind, behind his back, off of the wall, off of the ceiling, then right into that thing! It was actually an amazing shot. Ooh, this is like one of these shows about bad restaurants. Let's open everything and investigate more. I was awfully generous with the health, even though I don't even have 100 HP yet. What was that about? <laughs> well, that was horrible. I was beginning to compost. What was to say? Keep the kitchen clean. Wash your hands. Seriously, wash your hands. Yeah, I agree. Well, oh, your egg. Phew, thought for sure I was gonna be someone's breakfast. This is that time there's no one to clean it up. Life is an easier as an egg. <laughs> this. this. this is amazing. Here's the sink. Okay. Oh, what's in here? Oh, Goombas! Oh my god, that was scary. This, okay, this is this is fun. Oh my god, he's on me! Oh my god, watch me! We need the sink, right? Wash your hands. No, that doesn't work, I guess. Get all those things, Mario. Do you know how that looks to have them crawling around in the kitchen? <laughs> yeah, what the frick do I do about this one on me? Wow, you're a freaking fly, you little buzzer. <laughs> hey, you got one of those things on you, Mario. Get them off. How? How the frick do I do this? Do I wash my hands? How do you do this? I'm getting wrecked here. Oh, and they're in here too! Oh my, that, oh my god, look at that one. That, that, is, that is so cute. Come on, stand on it. And that explains what this is for. This is like my time limit or something? Gotta get, contain those things, Mario. Wrestle like this can't have the vet crawling in it. That sounds racist. Can we go further out? You're not on me anymore. And now you're on me. That is weird. Oh, hi. How do I get this one off? Looks like you get them off. How? Is he on the fire? Okay. Terrifying. 
a monster. Do you have to cherry on there? Sure. Just we'll take care of it. What the hell? What am I supposed to do here? You gotta use a frickin' item? Yeah, yeah. I use that when I'm getting really low. Seriously, wash your hands. Yeah! Oh, you just gotta spin around, okay. That was annoying. This is hard to... You gotta see through I know. Okay. Oh, okay. You can't really see him too good. He's look, he don't look at the Going today like that, he's gonna when he starts moving. Yeah. I don't know if I see a steer. He looks like a wasp. What are you supposed to do now? What was all that about? Cheers out the I know. What's that about? Anything else in here? Huh. Oh, we have to talk to the chef Ted? Is that the problem you want us to fix? I don't hear the pitter patter of a little pest anymore. You did it. Here, I hope you enjoy this finally leaf sock confetti. Bon appetit. Alright, thank you! Thank you! Man, this place has an interesting gimmick. I mean, I could just leave and try to get more confetti, but that would just probably take longer, you know? And that's all the confetti! Like I was barely gonna make that, honestly. See, it's all the way over here first. Oh, I like these little these these look like sprites for like Mario One. That's pretty cool. Gonna make me go all the way around. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. Tell us the point it's Oh, what's this? The hammer's not working. I don't know what that is. And go around the other side. Walked out, it doesn't look like pushing a in it. How can we get to the top if we can't get in there? Ugh! I don't want one of those sticks! Oh, this is what we gotta do! Oh my god, it's a freaking pencil missile! That's amazing! Because I had to hit it at the right time. Or maybe not. Just keep coming, got to get out of here! Oh, this is what we gotta do! Oh, this is something on my face! 
Alright, that's clever. Alright, that was pretty clever. And then they just abruptly stopped for some reason. Oh my god, this is amazing. This game is amazing. Ooh, hearts. Am I just stand under here? Oh, clever. Ow. Hearts. I love this game. Oh! I love this game. <laughs> I love this game. Oh man, I thought for sure they'd throw me out with all the other broken pencil bits. Thank you! This is the top level of the tower, but I swear this clever pencil things can fly down from above. Whoops! No, 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 no! Well, that was stupid. I guess we get to see this again. Still amazing though. Seven eight six. Is this the same spot where we were attacked on the elevator? <laughs> Surprise me. Oh my God! Look at the eight bit Mario death. Oh, that's adorable. Last time. Yep. There's the end of the streamer! And that's my brother's face right in the middle! He's really making sure everyone knows this was him! Should we try to detach it somehow? Ooh! Maybe he jumped into it from below! Hmm, is that the most powerful jump you can do? Oh. Yeah, I was way too close. I wish the six would stick to their own business. Oh man, you're almost out of the picture for good. Yikes. What the hell are you? Oh my god. The missile maestro card. <laughs> oh my god. I was not expecting this. I'm sick and tired of Philistines like you erasing all of my hard work, man. Oh, look at that text. You probably haven't heard of me, right? Figures, when was the last time you even went to the gallery? Not long ago, actually. Don't answer. I'm gonna give you an art lesson for free. The name's jean Pierre Colored Pencils the 12th. I represent the Legion of Stationery, I'll have you know. Anyway, I'm going to streamer, and I'll scribble on your flat face if that's what it takes to stop you. Legion of Stationery? jean P P That's too long for me to remember! I'm just gonna call you colored pencils, okay? I suppose my brother sent you to try and stop us, right? Well, colored pencils, you talk tough and you draw really well, but have you even heard of Mario? Yeah, that's what I thought. Mario is tough and he's got a mustache and he's gonna mess you up. Right, Mario? Alright, second boss. I guess the first one was the mini boss. So, this is the first proper boss. Feast your eyes upon my art symbol. Twelve colored pencils ready to make your paper bodies my canvas. Use the arrows! Lock on targets. Oh, wow. Hmm, that magic scroll doesn't look like it has any power. Is it on break? Oh, wait, what's that? This is the first time I've seen a pencil like that. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. Let's... It looks kind of like a switch. Maybe it activates something. Oh, wow, this is going to be a nightmare. So, basically... Oh, 
let's keep it simple for now. Uh, that'll lead into that. Just, uh, see what that does. Okay, it actually exposes it. Good. They all miss? No, my missiles are flawless. It's the target that's all wrong. <laughs> yeah, good point. <laughs> Aha! I don't do collaboration, so hands off! Oh wow, that was a waste of a turn then. Once I unleash my full artistic vision, let's see you handle the rest of my missiles all at once! Jeez Louise, this is horrible. Reload complete. I have plenty more where these came from. Alright, what do we have to do first? Maybe we have to attack it normally first? Okay, that's kind of a weird setup, but let's just see what happens. Like, why is this one so far out? What can I do? Let's go Iron Boots. Behind him? <laughs> I don't really understand what we're trying to do. Hmm. <laughs> what if we get behind him? Alright, so we'll go that way, down, and right, and across. Okay. We could put on the intermediate space. He seems in that chunk of chest. We'll even get a heart to, to boot! Oh, so that's it? That's lame? That was kind of lame, honestly. Let's see what uh, Hammer does. No, no, I let us close! I can't stop my missiles! <laughs> okay, so we gotta just close them! The missiles explode in its mouth! Awesome! I guess this chatterbox mouth is its weak spot. Heh. <laughs> is it sun now? Can we use a thousand arms? This probably means we can use a thousand arms. Okay. Oh, we gotta get around him again. Uh... How do we do this? Put you there. And I'll put you here. Oh my. 
that's good. <laughs> Is this a good angle to be? Ha! Nice try! That didn't do anything. Did you enjoy my biting critique? Okay, I don't really understand how that works. So maybe if I close him from behind, that'll do missiles, I guess? <laughs> yeah, that makes sense, makes sense. I guess if he can't walk over those spots at all, maybe that's, is that the, the gimmick? Across there, we're gonna go down there. No, that's not gonna work. We need to be down here. Let's give me more time. <laughs> Well, I'll hit the on switch. <laughs> Let's see what this does. What am I gonna do from this angle? I guess I didn't time that well. Okay. Alright, that was a pretty bad turn. Should grab those plus things, honestly. Wait, the switch is still active? Oh, does that work? This would pro probably work. And those are fun, I guess. Like, this angle should work, right? You gotta be directly behind it, it's a problem. Probably use a mushroom. Or try to get one of those hearts. 